This is a question set on ages. Let us get started with the first question. Akshay is younger than Salman by 4 years. If their ages are in the respective ratio of 7 is to 9, how old is Akshay? So we have been given that Akshay is younger than Salman by 4 years. If the age of Akshay is A, we can say that it is equal to Salman's age which is S minus 4. Now if their ages are in the respective ratio of 7 is to 9, so their ages are in the respective ratio of 7 is to 9. So A by S is equal to 7 by 9. So this is, we can write S is equals to A plus 4. So we have to find out Akshay's age. So let us put this S equals to A plus 4 in this equation. We can have A upon S's value is A plus 4 is equal to 7 by 9. So 9 goes to the left. So 9A is equals to A plus 4 goes to the right. So 7A plus 7 fours are 28. So 9A minus 7A is 2A is equals to 28. Therefore A is equals to 28 by 2 that is 14. So Akshay's age is 14 years. So option D is the right answer. Let us move on to the second question. The ratio between the present ages of A and B is 6 by 7. If B is 4 years old than A, what will be the ratio of ages of A and B after 4 years? The ratio between the present ages of A and B is 6 is to 7. So we can write A by B is equal to 6 by 7. And B is 4 years old than A. So we have B is equals to A plus 4. What will be the ratio of the ages of A and B after 4 years? So after 4 years the ratio will be A plus 4 by B plus 4 and that is what we have to find out. Now how can we find that out? Well if you put this value of B in this equation you can get the value of A and thereafter you can get the value of B and then solve this equation. So put B equals to A plus 4 in this equation we get a by b is a plus 4 so a by a plus 4 is equals to 6 by 7 therefore 7a is equals to 6 times a plus 4 which gives us 6a plus 24 6 fours are 24 now 7a minus 6a gives you a is equal to 24 so a's value is 24 now we can find out B's value. B's value is equal to A plus 4 and A is 24. So 24 plus 4. Therefore B is equal to 28. We have A's value. We have B's value. Put these values into this equation and get the ratio of their ages after 4 years. So I can write A's value is 24. So 24 plus 4 the value of this equation. 24 plus 4 by B's value is 28, so 28 plus 4, and that is equals to 28 by 32. If I divide this by 4, I get 4 times 7 as 28 and 4 times 8 as 32. Therefore, the ratio is 7 by 8. So the answer is option A. The next question the ratio between the present ages of P and Q is 5 is to 7, respectively. If the difference between Q's present age and P's age after 6 years is 2, what is the total of P's and Q's present ages? So the ratio between the present ages of P and Q is 5 is to 7. So P by Q is equal to 5 by 7. Now if the difference between the present age of Q, so we have Q's present age minus P's age after 6 years, so P's age after 6 years will be P plus 6 is 2. So this is equal to 2. We have been asked what is the total of P's and Q's present ages. So what we have been asked is P plus Q. Let us resolve this further. We get Q is equals to this P plus 6 goes to the right hand side of equals to. So we get 2 plus P plus 6. Therefore Q is equal to P plus 8. Now put this value of Q in this equation and get the value of P. So we get P by Q's value is P plus 8. So P by P plus 8 is equal to 5 by 7. 
therefore 7p is equal to 5p plus 5 8s are 40 therefore 7p minus 5p which is 2p is equal to 40 therefore p is equal to 20 now put this value of p is equal to 20 in this equation and get the q's present age so we have q is equal to p is 20 so 20 plus 8 therefore q's present age is 28 years we have p and q we have been asked what is the total of p and q's present ages so p plus q which gives us 20 plus 28 and that is equals to 48 so the answer is option a the fourth question at present the ratio between the ages of arjun and deepak is 4 is to 3 after 6 years arjun's age will be 26 years what is the age of deepak at present so let us consider the ages of arun and deepak as a and d so the ratio between their ages is 4 is to 3 so i can write a by d is equals to 4 by 3 now after 6 years arjun's age will be 26 years so we can write a plus 6 is equals to 26 now what is the age of deepak at present well this is very simple we can find out the age of arun at present from this equation we get a is equals to 26 minus 6 therefore a is equals to 20 years put this value of a in this equation and get deepak's present age so a is 20 so 20 by d is equals to 4 by 3 so i get d is equals to 20 by 4 times 3 d goes here 4 comes down 3 goes to the left this is equal to 4 times 5 is 20 so 5 times 3 and 5 times 3 is 15 so D's present age is 15 years so option B now the final question present ages of X and Y are in the ratio of 5 is to 6 respectively 7 years hence this ratio will become 6 is to 7 respectively what is X's present age in years so we have been given the present ages of X and Y in the ratio of 5 is to 6 so X by y is equals to 5 by 6 so from this 6x is equal to 5y and i can write 6x minus 5y is equal to 0 let us name this equation 1 let's see what else has been given to us 7 years hence this ratio will become 6 is to 7 respectively so after 7 years x will be x plus 7 and y will be y plus 7 is equal to 6 by 7 so from this I get 7x plus 49 7 7 the 49 is equal to 6y plus 6 7 the 42 so 7x minus 6y is equal to 42 minus 49 that is minus 7 let us name this equation 2 now these are simultaneous equations we can solve this let us eliminate y so equation 1 multiplied by 6 minus equation 2 multiplied by 5 let's see what we get so equation 1 is multiplied by 6 so i get 6 times 6 is 36 x minus 6 5 is a 30 so 30 y is equal to 0 and equation 2 is multiplied by 5 so 7 5 is a 35 x minus 5 6 is a 30 so minus 30 y is equals to minus 7 times 5 is minus 35 and we have to subtract equation 1 from equation 2 so this becomes minus this becomes plus minus times minus is plus and minus times minus is plus again here 36 x minus 35 x is equal to x this 30 y and minus 30 y gets cancelled out is equals to plus 35 so 35 therefore x is equals to 35 so we have our answer Access present age is 35 years.